Welcome to your first lesson in this online course. This online course is based off the textbook Our California, which is meant for fourth grade students that live in California. The first lesson is called Why Was the U.S. Constitution Created? First, let's set the scene for our lesson. When you play a game with your friends, who decides what the rules are and whether or not they are fair? More than 200 years ago, the founders of the United States met in order to write a constitution or a plan for the government of a country. What rules for the new country did the U.S. Constitution include? Key vocabulary that can be found in this lesson are convention, which is a large meeting arranged for a special purpose, principle, which is an important belief, amendment, which is a change or addition, and responsibility, which is a duty or something that must be done. A new government. The United States was not created all at once. In 1776, the Declaration of Independence was written. It stated that American colonists wanted to be free from Great Britain. After the colonists fought and won a war against Britain, they had to decide what kind of government their new nation would have. In 1787, representatives and the states held a convention in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. At the convention, the representatives decided what kind of government that they wanted for their new country. In the end, they decided on a federal system. At this constitutional convention in 1787, the Founding Fathers met at the Independence Hall in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. At the, at the convention, the representatives did not agree on the structure of their new government. Some of them believed that it would be best to have one strong central government with most of the power over all the states. Others felt that it would be better to give the individual states more control. In the end, the representatives decided on a federal system in which power is shared between the states and the central government. The U.S. Constitution was ratified in 1788. Changes to the Constitution The Constitution describes the structure for the government. It reflects the principles or important beliefs of the people of the United States. One important fact about the Constitution is that it can be changed. These changes or additions are called amendments. The first 10 amendments were ratified in 1791. They are known as the Bill of Rights and they protect the rights and freedoms of all citizens. What are the Bill of Rights? Like we said earlier, the Bill of Rights are the first 10 amendments and were ratified in 1791. They are rights that protect the U.S. citizens and give them certain freedoms. As shown in this visual, here is what the, the Bill of Rights are. The first amendment is freedom of speech, religion, press, assembly, and petition. The second amendment is the right to bear arms. Third amendment is courting of soldiers, quartering of soldiers. Fourth Amendment is for the right of arrests and searches. The Fifth Amendment is the rights of persons accused of crimes. The Sixth Amendment is the rights of persons on trial for crime. Seventh Amendment are the right to have jury trials in civil cases. The Eighth Amendment gives limitations on bail and punishments. The Ninth Amendment are rights kept by the people. And the Tenth Amendment are the powers kept by the states or the people. You have completed the basics for lesson one. Make sure that you watch any other videos that are found on our course online course website or any other activities that need to be completed before moving on to week two. Also remember to complete the lesson quiz before moving on. Great job!